It's been three years since Guilford County commissioners approved a $10 million security bond to make Guilford County schools safer. In light of the recent classroom fight at Southern Guilford High School, many parents question where did that money go? WFNY News 2's Jess Winters asked Superintendent Dr. Sharon Contreras. Whatever happened to the $10 million Guilford County commissioners approved for Guilford County Schools safety and security upgrades in 2018 has become the $10 million question. The answer? The district has only seen a fraction of those funds. Between a mix of miscommunications, county approval delays, and a pandemic-related shift of funding needs, Superintendent Dr. Sharon Contreras says GCS has only gotten $63,000 so far for security. The message that has gone out into the community is that the district just sat on their hands for, uh, since 2018. It's been three years, but we have not received the funding. The district later asked county commissioners for money to help reopen schools with COVID-19 protocols in place. Dr. Contreras said commissioners pulled $5 million from the security bond to make that happen. We didn't ask them to use the safety and security money. They chose to use that for to help us reopen. So really, there's only about $4.9 million left. After conversations with commissioners last week, Contreras says the district will be getting that money soon. While it will help us with making sure we have radios to make sure that emergency uh, management services can come in and be on the same frequency, it won't do much in terms of uh, the massive amount of facility needs we have for safety and security. Jess Winters, WFMY News 2.